Hey, hello and welcome back to my sixth campaign of Baldur's Gate 3, currently playing as Will Ravenguard. It is time to continue our journey in the second act of this game. And last time, Mintara just joined the party and she is now a sorcerer. Yeah, level 9 sorcerer, draconic bloodline. Fun. She's gonna travel with us. Let's talk to... I, I want to be clear. Letting Minthara tag Historian. along with us was your idea. Mm -hmm. So if you wake up with a dagger to your throat, that's on you. Well, jealous you're no longer the least trustworthy person in our camp? Uh, excuse me. I'm sorry for looking out for our collective hides. But fine. Take her if you wish. Just know I'll be resting with one eye open. <laughs> Same. It doesn't seem long ago that Mintharu would have sought to kill us, and now we've welcomed her along. We're nothing if not magnanimous. Ooh, I could force you guys to use the powers. What's next? Checking things out. Hey, you. Got nothing to say? All right. Wait. We got a long rest first. So, anybody wants to talk? Gail, all you want to do the thing? Good evening. I'm here on behalf of Gail of Waterdeep. He wishes to extend you an invitation for a private conversation Screenshot. in a more suitable locale. Later, perhaps? Perhaps later she'll be too late. I would urge you to reconsider, lest the opportunity prove to be a fleeting one. Not interested. Shame. He will be most disappointed, I fear. Not today. Right. Oh yeah, we have all to select. A new day full of opportunities. First, let's buff up. Whatever comes, I'm ready. Don't burn yourself. We don't have long strider anymore. There is work to do. So, if there's something that I can do to summon scratch. armor I can waste my spell slots right now I can roll with my weapons or cantrips dude why do I have a yeah it's my shield that's why I have a spell slot I can use hex right Great, so let me use this. Yeah. In your name. What am I to do? You no time to waste. Blinding strike. This one costs us spell slots. Okay, um, yeah, we can use aid at third level. Can 
can also by my oath. Min Mintara. Proceeding. What is wrong? Alright, fine, we're not doing this. Just you cast aid on the part, please. Use the necklace and restore the spell slots. The pride of the gate. And we are ready to continue our journey. You wish to consult me? Yes. Is Catherick truly invulnerable? I fought at his side once. Shortly after my... conversion. Before the battle, he was everything a general should be. A charismatic leader with a brilliant strategic mind. And when the fighting began, he led his troops from the front and cut through the enemy like a scythe through stalks. Blows and arrows rained down on him, and before long, his face was a mask of blood. But he did not fall. He did not even falter. When we won the day, Ketherick's armor was bent and shattered, but his flesh was unmarked. Well, what chance do we have? Every chance. Once he is stripped of his power, the necromancer Balthazar is Ketherick's chief advisor. One who has mastery over the dead the may well of you. be able to help the living <laughs> cheated. Dracon Sorcerer Mintara we should ransack different his chambers and see what secrets he keeps for the great general. You're no longer a paladin, so I, I took, will though my faith get is shattered. This. Any who object to the laws of that world will have. No more. Let's go. Gotta sell some items. And we'll go and save the tieflings. Hopefully they are still alive. Oh look, a torch just for you. The pride of the gate. Everyone what? Hi. Ever at your service. I'll buy that, thank you. Right. An honor. can get the better version of uh, Shadow Hearts amulet. So you restore any type of spell slots. Hold up somewhere planning to burst in spells ablaze and rescue us. <laughs> I bloody hope not. If he saves us, I'll never hear the end of it. Where are the parents of Arabella? Your friendly face. Did you request this post too? I'm glad I got the warden and not Zarel. Don't get chatty with the prisoners, mind you. The warden won't like that. Shatter. 
don't speak to the prisoners. The Absolute forbids it. Why? The Warden runs this place you like cool. clockwork. Do not fall behind. All right, let's start with the Warden then. Wait, so there's two enemies and two scrying eyes. Hmm. There's a third, third one here and the Warden, right? Hmm. You spark of the familiar. Do I know you, true soul? Hmm. Perhaps not. Your face is rather bland. Whatever I am your the blade business, of frontiers. A warning. None may speak to the prisoners. Disciple Balthazar was most clear. I'm looking for a particular prisoner, Duke Ravengard. He sounds important, and I'm afraid the mere dregs are the only ones left in my care. Well, the rules don't apply to me. Is that so? If you are above the General's chief advisor, you must be most impressive. I'm Ketrick's new favorite. So easy? That one. Okay. <laughs> How did I get 22? They always think that. From a five. I'm not sure why someone of your stature must converse with prisoners. Perhaps a small donation would convince me. Fine. Pockets running a little empty, are they? Disciple Balthazar's orders still stand. None may speak to the prisoners. You can go now. I could kill you, you know. <laughs> Please try. I could use a laugh. <laughs> Can't bribe them all. <laughs> I don't think I ever got to a, that one before. Noble. If it is for the best. Steady. Excuse me, bitch. You were witnessed assaulting someone. You're Taking up position. Sorry, you have shatter. Means you have arc in equity and lightning charges as well. Oh my, you have fire resistance. Let's go for this one right well, away. Well. <laughs> Lovely crit. So it's done. Start eating right, weapons then. That. Hopefully they can't push me. Shadowheart is standing in a very bad location right now. No healing for you. Combat. Oh, I 
that blocks view. Hmm. Ready for battle. Got some arrows for Starion. Plus one weapon and spell crux amulet. Amazing. It's probably for Mintara for now. Oh wait, I had that. Oh, that's right, I did not use elixirs. So, as will, I take that so I don't have to care of this until the very end of the game. Shadow Heart. It's a good one. Cadillac. Guess we're all with Bloodlust. Mintara. You can roll with that, so you have an extra spell slot. Alright. Cool. Oh. Surprises. Heading out. Off limits. Perhaps the guard can. Oh, you fat ass.
the carrot. Oh hi. Reporting. I'm actually looking for you. The deep ones first. Yo. Let me guess. The absolute is the only way. Don't bother. Why don't you and Zevlor take a long walk off a short cliff? Listen, your brother. Roland is alive. He's in last light in. He made it? He's alright? Told you. He's too stubborn to die. If you're not at the Absolute's beck and call, why are you here? Save your asses. I have some things to get, take care of. Like what? Listen, we need to get out of here. Zev has killed us. These people are nuts. Gnomes next door are up to something. They've been whispering like mad. Whatever it is, we're in. Don't leave us in here. A word, if I may. Hey. I'll get it. You're in the grove, right? Yeah. I was. Please. Have you seen Bex? Dark hair, uh, golden eyes. Is she in another cell? Is she all right? She's at the last light in with the others. She's safe. She got away. Oh, Thank the gods! Thank you. I, I was sure the curse. Look, tell her to go to Baldur's Gate. I'll meet her there. There must be a way out of here. Please, I don't want to end up on some necromancer slab. Well, give me my gold back. You're our one shot of getting out of here. Don't leave us behind. Get us out of here before the necromancer comes back. Please. Whoa. That was crazy. Until we're served up to the necromancer on a platter. We'll get you to Boulder's Gate, sir. I swear it. Hello. Nimble. Check for gaps, cracks, anything to leverage the rock. Nickels, tools. Get creative. This rock is basalt. It'll crack with enough pressure. Ah, don't mind us, true soul. The back wall is weak. We're working to brace it. You're clearly planning an escape. <laughs> I wouldn't be so foolish as to think I could escape the absolute. The warden has eyes everywhere. And ears. Well, except she's dead. What if I were here to help you escape? Huh. And why would you be so inclined? Because Barkus told me you were here and asked me to help. Barkus is out here? Mm, didn't think he had the stones. Well, if he sent you, you're no slave to the Absolute. You're a damn wolf among sheep, aren't you? <laughs> I reckon you and I were meant to meet. I'm Wilbrun. I'm Will. Blazer to meet you. We've got a plan. For us and the tieflings both. But we're scuppered without the right equipment. We need tools. That head case of a warden robbed ours. But anything that breaks rock will do. Even if it's not iron hand quality. Whatever you find, throw it through the bars. But for the love of Gerdor, make sure a guard doesn't see you. Or we're both done for. They're dead. Don't worry about them. Your feet fly fast, my friend. Any luck with those tools? I found this hammer. It's yours? Blessed Gerdor, I thought I'd never see it again. Thank you.
The plan is to wait for a quiet moment, then bust out the back wall. We'll grab the tieflings along the way. We'll need them if it comes to a fight. You, however, are the clincher. Once we move, keep the patrols busy. If the bastards spot us, all of bloody Moonrise will come down on us. All right. We'll move once it's quiet. Until then, be ready. Please tell me that everyone can jump up. My face protects Obviously me. Obviously you can jump up. Hey, ho. Obviously you can jump. Awaiting orders. TP. TP. Sharp as ever. Scratch can follow me, right? Maybe he gets teleported. Ooh, almost been squicked. You know what doesn't help when you're frantically trying to untie your... <laughs> Boat's good to go. My plan for now is to hide out on the water. Safe? It is safe. Let's go. Hey, screenshots. Skip. You drift through the dark until time, skill, or luck brings you to Last Light's dock. What? Hold there. You can't just land and start unloading strangers. They're procedures, damn it. No one gets in without being tested. Commander Jahira's orders. Jahira ordered all Harpers to let me come and go as needed. The commander cleared you, not your friends. Anyone could be infected, so we're checking all new faces. No exceptions. It, form a line. Let's see if the Absolute's little pet recognizes any of you the absolutes what what are you doing just do as he says trust me this is the easy way if what you said is true no one has anything to fear if not well we'll soon find out they could have put a plot this over here maybe some of them no, was form a line. Infected or something. Again. Instead of uh, just killing some tieflings out, killing off off screen death, they could have put a you know a death cutscene over here, or like you need know, to attack someone, or you know keep them alive. Then suddenly they transform in Act Three or something, you know. Of course, Scratch is still here. Right. You wish to consult me? Yeah. Uh, do you remember all that you did in the Absolute's name? I was the Absolute's dagger. 
I remember every throat that it held me to. It's a better, and every drop better of background for that screenshot. To spill. I take no responsibility for the lives I took. I did nothing in the Absolute's name. I was merely a weapon that it wielded. You should take responsibility for your actions. They were not my actions. You have been protected from the worst of the Absolute's influence. <sighs> Understanding what was done to me is beyond you. All right, all right. One move ahead. The arc vision became pretty pointless in this game. Yeah, deep side narrows at night time. Like in early access, it was insane that you needed dark vision everywhere. Now it's so easy to counter it. See if there's anything you need. We don't know when the next blow might land. Yeah, but am I alright by Jahira? Look at all the tasty rotten food. Mm. Hey, avoid balls, nice. You need my expertise. Well, the next time I level you up. I will obviously take the dual wielder feet, so you can dual wield quarter stacks. Right. What now? We had stone or steel ever onward. I wish we had a bloody... The Flaming Fist may be a bit rough, but I've respected them. Didn't expect a traitor in their ranks. Shit happens. Roland! Oh, thanks for God. Did you enjoy relaxing here while I battled that wretched darkness? What were you thinking? I'm sorry, we got captured by murderous lunatics! I thought you were dead, you ass! Both of you! We're all safe, Roland. That's what matters. Well, Roland was in a bad state without you two. I was just overwhelmed. Doesn't matter. I'm sorry. We should have been here. No, no, it's it's not your fault. I, I shouldn't have shouted. I'm sorry. Thank you for saving me. And the two idiots. <laughs> this is the last time I risk my life for you lot. That's more than fair. Thank you for helping us when most wouldn't. And when others, such as myself, failed miserably. You went out of your way to help us. It's only right you get something in return. Here. I hope it helps. Money! Thank you. I never thought I'd see these two again. It's good to be back. <laughs> 
I've thanked you once already. Don't be greedy. All right. I'm not the best at showing it, but I love Cal and Roland to death. They're family. Thank you for bringing us back together. I'm a bit, I have been so curious about the different dialogues if one of them dies. Like, what if Roland dies in the dark and you save these two? What if Cal or Leah dies or both of them dies while we're trying to escape? I'm pretty sure there's dialogue for each character then. No. Everything goes downhill for Roland in Act 3 then. Also, for us, Arthur, if that is a nice problem. We're two tiefling queens, remember? I couldn't leave my favorite bard without her partner in crime. I did have some help from an old friend, though. That's me. How did you do it? Well, I was in Moonrise and I just happened to run into her. Don't play coy. You could have left us behind, but you didn't. You should have seen him. He was brave, but also terrifying. In a good way. Oh, I never thought I'd see... Well, anyone again. Thank you. A thousand times, thank you. One last favor. Take this off my hands. It suits you better. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the potent robe. Your cantrips deal additional damage equal to your charisma modifier. Well liked and well fortitude. Uh, fortified, sorry. <laughs> That's what, not what it says. At the beginning of the Vera's turn, the robe activates, granting them temporary hit points equal to their charisma modifier. Plus one AC. Would you look at that? I mean, Mintara just got this. Although, she would be a beast with those cantrip damages. And I'm pretty sure there is a necklace that I have on someone that deals additional damage again for cantrips. I can't really use this, huh? Well, I'm not really scoring crits. Oh, but this one also helps me with the thing. But obviously, it's me or Mintara. Alright. Oh, but the carrying capacity. Ugh. Right, wait, hide that stupid helmet. Things in Moonrise were bad. Real bad. Thank you for getting me out of there. You're welcome. The shadows haven't consumed you. Good. I saw Catherick. He regent before my eyes. Gruesome, isn't it? I'm glad you survived the encounter, at least. Did you learn anything more? Catrick is calling himself a Chosen of the Absolute now. Chosen? Oh, that's three masters Catrick has served. Our paladin isn't very picky. <laughs> He's aligned himself with mind flayers. But I cannot see what he gains. Perhaps we can force it out of him once we have him up against a wall. Was there anything else? Nope. The great general is paranoid. Good. That means he's protecting something. I'll wager it's the source of his invulnerability. He'd protect that at any cost. Was there anything else? Nope. So... Oh yeah, Marcus. Ah, there you are. Everyone seems to be quite a flutter. Do you know why? I did what you asked, ready for my reward. 
You mean... But that means... Walbrin! Here, take this. Quickly. I give you the brilliant retort. Now, I need to go find Walbrin. <laughs> Walbrin! No. Right. The perimeter's clear, ma'am. Good. We'll leave soon. And we don't want any surprises. Of course, I also did not forget about yes, you, His Majesty. Hiss. I say hiss. Hiss. I see. Yes. Perhaps <laughs> you're right. Good. I'd like it if we could have a civil discussion. Fine. What's your name? I call myself His Majesty. I could use someone like you in my camp. Care to join? I'd rather die. <laughs> How did you get to this place? It was quite straightforward. I slinked. Heard anything interesting around here? Plenty of pointless banging about. The only highlight was when the cleric here promised me a bit of milk that is yet to materialize. My conclusion? She's a liar. How about you? No wolfy line. Oh. Right? No. Really Can I mention this to yes. Isabel? Where's the goddamn milk? Hmm. The milk. Wolfen, please. No surprise to find a traitor among the flaming fist. Honor isn't their strong suit. There's no honor among fists. You did well to help those people escape Ketherick. Every soul saved is a blessing, and you're raining them upon us. Hmm. It was a team effort. Like most things in life. My thanks to your team. You work well together. I saw Ketrick at Moonrise Towers. He was presiding over a trial. Presiding? Almost laughable. Is that how you say, pronounce he that? He sees himself fit to judge anyone. Did you learn anything about how we might defeat him? Not yet, but I think I'm on the right track. That's fantastic. Well done. I'm glad you've made progress. Protecting this inn. Well, it takes it out of you. I'll hold out as long as I can. By the sound of things, we'll have a more permanent solution soon. So glad you're on our side. Go on, then. I don't know much about you. Care to fill in the blanks? I could say the same. But perhaps we should save the trivia we're on the other side of this thing promise not to die and we'll celebrate with our life stories this curse seems incredibly powerful what more can you tell me about it it belongs to the goddess Shah. according to the harpers it fell here when they defeated Ketherick, the one who tried to have me kidnapped i suppose they didn't defeat him quite hard enough I'm not overly familiar with Saloon and Shar. Could you enlighten me? Moon and Shadow. Light and Dark. Divine sisters ever at war. And this place has become one more battlefield. Sometimes life forces us to choose sides. Luckily, sometimes the choice is obvious. How did you come to this place? Right place, right time. When a cleric of Saluna stumbles into a Shar and Shadow, She's bound to set it to rights, at any cost. All right. I've looked worse. I've definitely looked better. <laughs> One move ahead. All right. Now let's talk with. Uh... Wolverine and Barakus, then we can end this episode. Keep it short. Wolverine! 
Ah, uh, I heard you might be about. Uh, how the devil did you get stuck here, Barkas? <laughs> I'm not stuck. I came to find you, of course. Why would you do a foolish thing like that? Really, Barkas? <laughs> Unfortunately for me, you're my friend. Rescuing you from mortal peril is my right. But you didn't rescue me, did you? I rescued myself, with the aid of this... helper. Ah, it's you. I should have guessed. Thank you very much for your help finding Walbrin. You don't belong here, Barkas. As soon as the way is clear, pack up and head to Baldur's Gate. But... W Walbrin... The rune powder... We need to discuss what you're going to... I said go home! Brick. Say that again. Brick. Let's not be uncivilized. Uh, Walbrin, perhaps we can talk more later. When you've had a moment to settle in. Sure. Now, I've business to attend to. Good day to you both. Well, there we have it. Walbrin is safe and sound. Fuck Thanks to you. Bong. I owe you a great deal. And that's Thank all you. that I know from that uh, song. <laughs> well, you don't owe me, Barkus. If anything, Wilbrin does. One and the same. You really care about him, don't you? Uh, well, uh, once you're used to someone, you're used to them. What will you do now, Barkus? Well, perhaps Wilbrin is right. Perhaps I ought to return to Baldur's Gate. Well, that will have to wait. It's lethal out there. Oh, that's all right. I'm a patient fellow. I'm, I'm sure you'll clear a path for everyone. Soon enough. Soon enough. Hopefully, I can finish this playthrough during the summer. I mean, this episode goes live probably in September, but I'm only recording this one on the second day of August. <laughs> yeah. Alright. We're bruised, battered, but I think, as I was saying, that is enough for today. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, and have a lovely, wonderful day or night. And what is missing from here? Nothing. Okay. So, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers! Why are you smiling at me? <laughs>